guys. Um, I don't normally do reviews on here, but I felt really led to do a review on this selfie stick that I just got. I have really noticed a decline in how things are being made in America, and it doesn't make me happy at all. I'm sure it doesn't make most of y'all happy, but most people just kind of turn a blind eye, and they're like, okay, whatever. I can remember when I was a kid that people would say, things just aren't made like they used to be. My grandma and grandpa would say that all the time, and they would just tell me how things were so much better back in the day. And... That is kind of disheartening. Um, I want to know that when I put out my good, hard-earned money for things, that I'm getting a quality product. And I do understand human error, and I understand that things happen sometimes. But it ought not to be the norm that you're getting cruddy products all the time. So I want to show you something on this particular selfie stick. It's by On, O-N-N -N dot. So, the first day I get it, my son and I noticed that literally it just pops right off. Now, this is the little button that allows you to hook it to your Wi-Fi on your phone so that it can be a hands-free thing where you don't have to touch the phone. You just touch this button and you can take pictures and video. Okay, y'all, seriously? This is put on with two-sided tape, double-sided tape, whatever they call it. That is sick. I mean... Guys, what would it take them to use like some Gorilla Glue or something? I mean, how how campy is this? That is, that's just really disappointing, y'all. Um, you know, overall, it extends very well. I'm going to have to do this with one hand here. I don't have my helpers. Uh, they're all out playing. But, uh, I mean, it extends well. Everything about it has been fine. All the mechanisms appear to work fine. I've only had it probably... Oh, about a week. I mean, it it's fairly easy to use. I mean, I, I've never had a selfie stick before, so I, I don't have a lot of basis for comparison. But I will say this, you know, not being a selfie stick pro, I am a consumer and I am a pro at knowing when something is not made well. And I'm sorry, On, but that is just shoddy. That is shoddy workmanship. That is not what I want to see from a company. And I think I need to tell you guys that we actually had bought a DVD player from On. I got it at Walmart. And we had to take it back within like three days because the thing would not even do any of the functions. I mean, the thing would freeze, it would skip, it would do all kinds of crazy things, and it was not our discs. We, we checked like 10 different discs. We did everything we could to make sure that it wasn't something on our part. And it wasn't, it just was not made well. I have not done a lot of research into this company. Um, I intend to, I wanna see kind of what they're all about. I don't know if they ship, uh, you know, kind of outsource um, outside of the United States. I'm A lot of companies do these days, which really doesn't make me happy either. Um, guys, it, it is just upsetting to me that things aren't made like they used to be. And, uh, you know, it's not a perfect world, but I sure would like to see things getting back to where hardworking people are working at factories and wanting to put out a good product for others. We should care about others. And, you know, my dad used to always say, you should treat others how you want to be treated. And if you want something to be made well, you need to make things well for others. You need to do the things that you want done unto you. I mean, that's that's scriptural. That's Bible right there. And that's just good common sense. And what do they say? The golden rule. So anyways, I don't want this to be long and drawn out. But um, do I recommend this selfie stick? Not really. Um, I'm going to get some Gorilla Glue or whatever my husband and sons recommend. And at this point, I don't feel like taking it back. I'm just going to make it work. Um, I know it doesn't seem like a big deal, just that the button fell off, but I mean, that's like the most major part of the selfie stick. And, and you know, I don't want to bag on this company, but, you know, I have had two things that were very basically shoddily made. And uh, so I think, you know, I want to call them out on it. So let me know if you guys have had a bad experience with this company as well. Uh, with some of their products. I mean, I personally, I don't know what the company is like. I shouldn't say that. But if you've had a, 
uh, any bad experiences with their products and, and what you think overall of this company. And hey, maybe this is just the way the world is, is headed. I'm seeing it in a lot of things. I'm seeing it in cars. You know, I'm, I'm seeing it in uh, housewares and appliances especially, which is really upsetting because appliances are not cheap. And you pay all that money and you get this cheesy old, you know, a dishwashers. Don't even get me started. We went above and beyond and bought a very expensive dishwasher that was not made well. So I'm not even going to go there. But have a great day. Thank you for watching. And I hope this was helpful to y'all. Bye.